Hello everyone, this is Dr. Tom here and what I'm doing now is recording a video to show you how you can embed that video into the discussion board. Uh, actually, uh, I, I do it all the time. If you noticed that the actual video shows in um, the, the actual window of the video shows rather than just putting a link in. But there are two ways to add a video to your discussion board post. Uh, I'm not going to go into how to record a video. Most of you should know that by now. Um, most laptops have a, a video um, um, <clears throat> that you can use. Uh, Blackboard has um, Camtasia. If I um, go into this discussion board here, this is the favorite intervention discussion board. Um, and if I want to reply, and I believe there is a way to um, record a um, Cultura Media. If you click on Cultura Media, you can. Okay. So here it is. And you come over here and it says add new. Um, webcam recording, video presentation, screen recording. Um, you can do a, a, either one of these. Um, and I'm going to try to do a um, webcam recording right now because that's what you will do. So right now it says uh, camera and microphone access. Yes, <laughs> I'm going to allow that. <laughs> um, but I'm also recording this, so... Um, so I click this to start recording, uh, testing. This is, this is my, um, my computer's camera, which is, um, not very good, but, um, anyway, I'm going to stop now. So I click this to start recording, uh, testing. I'm going to save it. Um, favorite. Intervention. Um, put a description here. Um, fave in, in, That's in, uh, you don't need to tag. You can. Uh, I usually tag my everything EDSC 640 and save. Back to browse and embed. So. Um, I'm going to embed this, so I'm just going to select it. And I don't like this all this here. I mean, especially me, I, I have used some videos and I reuse them because the content doesn't change. So I don't want this to say January 17th, 1970. <laughs> 1970. So I'm going to just highlight that and delete it. Um, I'm going to submit this. And, and there's, um, there's one way to do it. Um, I'm going to show you another way uh, to do your favorite, uh, to embed your favorite intervention. Um, I'm going to uh, use one. Um, I have, this is my, uh, my list of, so I'm going to uh, use Chris Coward. I've asked him for permission to do this. Uh, I'm going to click on it. And there's a couple of ways to put it in your discussion board. One is, um, right. hey, I'm, everyone, my name is. I'm going to hit share. That's the way most people do it. I'm going to copy the link, right click on it, copy it. I'm going to go into uh, the po my thread here and I'm going to um, control V and there's the um, link. I'm going to highlight it. I'm going to click on the link icon here. I'm going to, I've already copied the link, so I'm going to paste it now. It's already pasted in there. But if it wasn't, I would just do Control V uh, and I would click on this drop down box, open in a new window, because we don't want to leave Blackboard. So update, there's your link. All right, here's the way I like to do it. Um, go into your YouTube video, and you can see that it says share, embed, email. 
click on embed and now you see this long string right click copy now you're going to go into um, your thread and click on this HTML button when you see the HTML button go to the end of the string that's there hit return now control V and that paste the string in update and submit and now you'll see there's Chris Coward's video. All I have to do is click on it, and it plays. It doesn't, All right. it doesn't leave Blackboard. So now you have a link that'll take you out of Blackboard. If I click on that and go to Chris's link. Um, but that I'd rather do the embedding because you stay right in Blackboard. So that's my um, little tutorial on embedding links in Blackboard. Enjoy.